was first played back in 1961. And in the first half, they completely dominated their opponents and they led comfortably at half time by 110 to 14. This the Offaly goal. So it was a tough task facing Kilkenny then in the second half, but Kilkenny have never, never lost an All Ireland final with a Johnstown man as the team captain. But well, this year, Michael Phelan, wearing the number 13 jersey, carried that responsibility. So as we join the match then, referee Jerry Long is about to get the second half underway, and the commentator is Michal O'Murraherthy. Awfully leading by six points, seeking that first ever title in the vocational school's hurling. This is their half-forward, Dara Scully. 40 yards out, in towards the goal. Full forward, hand passing the ball out, and this is John Troy, and John Troy shot outside the 70, is the umpire. Offaly have been beaten in nine finals to date. They lead by six points, John Troy with the free. They lead by seven, 111 to 14 for Kilkenny. Declan Tobin, Kilkenny's goalkeeper. That's a very, very long puck out, almost down to the 50-yard line. Kilkenny needing a score. Stephen Reid getting the ball in. Austin cleared the full forward. Offaly backs recovering well, but good blocking down there by the Kilkenny forwards. 50-yard line, and the Offaly men good at the block as well. They lead by seven points as Damien Barden tries to get him forward for another one. Kilkenny substitute is Paddy Murphy. Inside the 50-yard line in towards Michael Phelan's corner. Referee blowing the whistle, giving a free in to Kilkenny. This is Brian Phelan, the free on the 21-yard line, over the bar, 1-5 for Kilkenny, but Offaly have won 11. Five minutes gone in the second half, and this is Damien Howe, Offaly's goalkeeper. That's the 70-yard line you see there, and Eamon Martin. Critical stage in the game, and Kilkenny Six points in arrears. Kilkenny have won this title on six occasions in the past. This is the Offaly left half back, Kevin Cleary. Has he room to swing? Barely. The ball out towards the wing, and there's Darris Gully again, and he gets a free for off. Damien Barton. And there's a good score there, Ger Torley. Offaly's corner forward, restoring their lead to seven points once again. Get another look at Ger Torley. Very, very little swinging room there. Bats coming from all sides. Swung nicely. 1 12 for Offaly. 1 5 for Kilkenny. Seven minutes gone in the second half. I wonder awfully on their way to their first ever title in this grade. This is Michael Field of Kilkenny, their captain. That's the 21 yard line. This is the 14 yard line. A goal by Michael Field. <laughs> and there he is again, breaking clear on the 50 yard line. Great ball control by the captain, Michael Field. Always going away, dodging the backs, and then a good shot as well, and suddenly Offaly's lead of seven is cut to four. There's the midfielder, Brian Phelan. A very, very long ball. Austin Clear trying to break it down. Here's Michael Phelan again. Right across the goal, Michael Phelan with a second goal in the space of 40 seconds. And that lead that was seven not too long ago, down to one. And Michael Phelan, the man that scored both goals, watched that for a long, long delivery from Brian Phelan. And watch how Michael Phelan steals in, leaving his marker away from him. No sign of his marker as he made that run. The shot was good. 
an awful lead by just one point right now. Michael Phelan, the scorer of the two goals, awfully attacking again. A free into Offaly and John Troy, he'll be the free taker. John has been in a superb form since the start of the game in general play and on freeze. 21 yards out, a little bit in the wing, no trouble at all to John and Offaly recovering their lead again by two points, 11 minutes gone in the second half. Kilkenny goalkeeper Declan Tobin, he'll try and get this past the centre of the field. Well past the 70 yard line, Offaly centre half back, no lack. Blocked the second time and Matty Walsh getting the ball in towards Austin Clear again and Austin Clear trying to get a shot at the goal and this is Austin Clear there striking it across hell by the goalkeeper Damien Howe. Damien Howe. Past the 70 yard line, Jimmy Carroll, that's a good catch by the Kilkenny left half. And there's Michael Phelan again, Michael Phelan dodging in. The low shot deflected, referee blowing the whistle, a free into Kilkenny. Jerry Long, the Tipperary referee, throwing the ball in the 21-yard line. Brian Phelan, he'll be the, the, well, Kilkenny people will say, he'll be the scorer. Brian Phelan. And Brian Phelan scoring the sixth point for Kilkenny, three goals and six to Offaly's once or thirteen. A one point lead for Offaly, 13 minutes gone in the second half. Damien House puck out for Offaly. Swinging over towards the left. Held there by Dara Scully. And Kilkenny is half of the field, Ger Torley again, Ger Torley, scorer of Offaly's last point from play, and this is a good shot from Ger Torley. Offaly lead by two points again, halfway through the second half, 1-14 to 3-6 for Kilkenny. Kilkenny, the two points down, the ball in the 50-yard line, the Offaly right half back clearing it well, he was Carl Mannion. Difficult to get this ball up with the stick right now. Plenty of players around. Offaly corner back, Henry Kilmartin. Kilkenny resorting to the hand pass. Good at that. In tight corners, Jimmy Carroll trying the long ball away down the field again. Full forward, Austin Clear trying to get at it. Austin Clear gets it and Austin scores for Kilkenny. They're full forward. 13 minutes to go to the end of the game. Offaly lead by one point. 114 to 3-7. Full forward with the boot out towards the sideline. Will it go out over the line? Held in play near the sideline. Kilkenny moving again. Michael Phelan standing out and getting the ball. This is Michael Phelan. Lovely stick walk. They need to dodge around players. Michael Phelan, the captain. They trail by one point. A good cross from Michael Phelan. Right across. Anything can happen right here. Ball in towards the full back. And the full back trying to get it out to the wing. And Plenty of hard pulling in there, and Jerry Long blows the whistle, giving a free in to Kilkenny. They trail by one point. Brian Phelan with a chance of the equaliser. Kilkenny been behind right through this game. We're within four minutes at the end of the game. Offaly still lead by one point. Ryan Phelan ties the scores, 3-8 for Kilkenny, 1-14 for Offaly, less than four minutes left in the game right now. Kilkenny, who've won this title six times in the past, Offaly, who've yet to win it, beaten in nine finals to date, right now they're level with Kilkenny. Sean Shefflin trying to get the ball in there for the Kilkenny man, cleared out over the line, a line ball for the Kilkenny players. Jimmy Carroll, 
on the 50 yard line. Low, but it might make a little bit of ground, but blocked by John Troy inside the way down the field. This is a chance for Offaly, the teams are level. A very, very good block in there by Dan Costigan. Offaly coming again, the half forward Eamon Martin to John Troy, whipping it in. Teams are level. And the ball cleared out by Jimmy Carl and Kilkenny. Lucky to get away there. The teams are level. Getting close to the end of the game. The ball down towards the 21-yard line. Sean Shefflin. Little bit of indecision there among the Offaly bats. And the ball out towards the line. Michael Phelan, the captain, once again. Turns neatly around. Michael Phelan. Lovely stick work to Austin Clare. Austin Clare and trying to get a shot at it, the backs covered it and trying to get it out, the ball sent out the side of the field. This is Matty Walsh, Matty with a swing, a shot and a point in the lead for Kilkenny. Two minutes from the end of the game, the centre forward Matty Walsh puts them into the lead. Damien Howe with a very, very vital puck out, vital to both teams, Kilkenny leading by one point. Jimmy Carroll again, he's played a very good second half for Kilkenny. In comes Matty Walsh again, slipping in from the wing, striking and stretching Kilkenny's lead to two points. We're within 90 seconds at the end of the game. Two very quick points by that man there, Matty Walsh. Offaly need a goal right now, less than a minute left in the game. The full forward trying to get it down the field, he is Neil Hand. He's been moved out the field, the last chance perhaps for Offaly. They're trailed by two points. The free has plenty of length in it, but turning to the left, out over the line and wide. So Kilkenny still lead by two points, and we're in the closing stages of the vocational hurling final. Kilkenny's goalkeeper, Declan Tobin. Lobbing it well down the field, almost to the second 50-yard line. Out to the 70-yard line, and they're moving again. This is the midfielder, Brian Phelan. Brian Phelan striking it in, held inside by Sean Shefflin. Sean Shefflin doesn't get a swing at it near the line, and the umpire hasn't signalled yet, but the referee has blown the whistle. Referee giving a free in to Kilkenny. The free in, no doubt, will be taken by Brian Phelan. They lead by two points, and Brian is not exactly in a hurry to take what might be the final free of the game. They lead by two points. The free is on the 21-yard line. And Brian Phelan sends it accurately over the bar, and Kilkenny, for the first time in the match, they lead by three points. Referee Jerry Long from Tipperary, a promising young referee, as the puck out is taken by Damien Howe, Offaly's goalkeeper. Referee Jerry Long blows the whistle, it's all over. Kilkenny have won, it's their seventh in all. Kilkenny won in 75, 6 and 7. They had won previously in 63, 72 and 73. And poor Offaly, they have yet to win, beaten 10 times in a row. But knowing Offaly, they'll be back to win again. Kilkenny captain Michael Phelan with the cup.